So my name is James Doran, I'm the executive chef here at the Game Bird Restaurant in the Stafford Hotel London. Uh, first dish we're going to be making is uh, grouse, so roast grouse, traditional roast grouse. The biggest inspiration for this dish is our restaurant, I mean we are the Game Bird and, and, and that's what, that's what we, we, we serve. So I think for me grouse is, is, is the first bird shot, it's the first of the season, glorious 12th on the 12th of August is, is kind of the, the, the start of the season. It is a truly wild bird, it's not reared unlike some pheasants and partridge and a certain amount of mallard. So it is shot and, and it's, it's, a, it's a big deal. I think the flavour is certainly unique, um, something I love and, and, and look forward to every year. With it being such a traditional dish, we don't really mess about with it. We keep it as traditional as we can and we serve it in the traditional way. The legs and the breast on, on, on any bird, whether it be a chicken, a, a quail, a grouse, are two such different muscles that we always cook them separate here. So we'll always take the legs off and we'll, we'll slow cook them. But we, we take the bird down, we'll butcher it, we take the, 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 the breast off and leave it on the bone, so on the crown. We take the legs away and take the thigh bones out of them. We use the offal, uh, so the hearts and the livers from inside the bird. We save that and we'll make a pate with that a little bit later. So the legs will then uh, roast off in a pan with a little bit of butter, some caramelised shallots in there, a little bit of garlic and thyme. Uh, we deglaze that with port. Then we add uh, brown chicken stock and white chicken stock, and then we slowly braise them legs down so they're really tender. They take about an hour and a half to cook really well. Once they're cooked, they come out of the out of the stock. Um, we pass all the other ingredients out of the stock for a fine chinois, and then we'll reduce that down. So then that creates our nice grouse flavoured sauce, basically. So we keep that to one side then. Okay, with the pate, so we get the, the 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 hearts and the livers from the bird. We mix it with a port and shallot reduction, a tiny little bit of pan fried duck liver and then we blend it, um, we blend it to create a lovely, a lovely really rich, gamey pate. Uh, that then gets spread onto a little brioche toasted crouton uh, and then uh, warmed later when we serve it. We roast the bird, pan roast it on the crown. Uh, takes a couple of minutes either side, give a nice caramelization all over the skin, keeping it nice and even, and then literally in the oven for a minute and a half, two minutes. The birds aren't that big, depending on the size of the bird and how long you've had it in the pan, but you kind of want it, you want to be served at medium rare really. Once the bird's been cooked in the oven, you kind of will rest that and give that a good two, three minutes to rest. Just let all, all, the, all that juice stay in the meat and, and just keep it really nice and moist. While that's happening, we'll braise some onions. So, so we get a pan, start with a little bit of oil, uh, add some butter, thyme and caramelise the onions off really, really nicely. We finish that with a touch of chicken stock and bring it down, reduce it right down so you get a really lovely glazed onion. Um, and that's it really, so we'll serve the breasts on the, on the plate. Uh, we use a little bit of onion puree here just, just, to, just to help with it, which again is just caramelised onions with a little bit of butter and cream. Uh, we finish it with the legs, the onions, the roast breast on the plate, and on the side we serve it with the game sauce, which we made from the, from the cooking liquor from the, the legs. We make a lovely bread sauce, um, which again is just a studded onion with cloves, uh, milk. Uh, we blend into it nice fresh breadcrumbs, and then um, we finish that with it with crispy fried breadcrumbs, which we fry in butter. And then on the side, we serve traditional game chips, which again, just potatoes, which we deep fried. And for me, the, the traditional grouse is served with roast grouse and, and, uh, and, and, and bread sauce. I think, you know, the, the, the little hints of cloves come through in the bread sauce, sweetens it all up a little bit. The grouse can almost have a, a kind of a bittersweet sort of flavor to it. It's got a, r a real strong um, gamey, gamey flavor to it. So the pate, again, is nice and rich and flavorsome. So it is a proper, kind of hearty, hearty kind of autumn winter dish. For me, it's, yeah, it's the richness of the bird, the richness of the sauce, uh, uh, and then that kind of sweetness to the bread sauce. And then we use, a, obviously, the crouton and the, and the breadcrumbs that we toast over the top gives the dish some nice texture to it as well.